Hello, hello, Sir David the Bard. I'm uh, coming to you from uh, Taipei, Taipei, China. Uh, this is a stopover for many um, airlines that fly down into uh, Asia and the Philippines, etc. And uh, <laughs> damn, Dan Danites were there in Utah when I was there. And let me tell you why, okay? I'm in Taipei and I'm safe. I think. I was uh, sitting in my chair, thrown, my usual position throughout the day, and uh, my wife, sweet mercy, walks into the room and she's got this great big bouquet of uh, candy, cookies, flowers. Now, I know she didn't buy that for me, so immediately my anus turned into a pretzel. Because I knew where that came from. So she started to bring it over towards me. <laughs> and I very calmly and very uh, respectfully started screaming, It's a cult! It's a cult! Get their shit out of here! Get it out of here! She said, well, I found it at the door. I said, Throw it in the trash! People hate me! You don't think they're going to put something in those candies? If I don't eat it, my family will and they'll die. And that'll make me suffer. Well, since she found out that Brigham Young lied about her skin color and has made her feel like shit because of the Book of Mormon and uh, the blacks her whole life, she said she's frustrated. I think she's pissed. Why did all of the church authorities tell the whole world but didn't tell the members first? So those like me are going to those that are still members and going, Oh, by the way, did you hear Brigham Young was an asshole and lied and he wasn't a real prophet? The people are shocked. They don't know what to say. They're all caught with their panties down. That's what the Mormon church wants. Because if it had been an announcement to the wards and the state, there would have been mass resignation. They're trying to hang on to as many members as they can. Anyway, I flew to, to Taipei here because uh, you can tell a Danite, a Mormon Danite is pretty tall compared to these little Chinese people. So I just have to watch out for tall people. They could have slanty eyes, I don't know. But they got to be taller than a, than a regular five foot Chinese. Now, <laughs> The Chinese today landed a robot on the moon. Hey, that's pretty cool. First time. It landed and it standing there seems to be working. Now, it's not working now. <laughs> it's from China. <laughs> My wife and I were laughing our ass off this morning. They, well, they got it there, but it isn't working. Take it back to Walmart. <laughs> Take that rover back to Walmart. Anyway, anyway. Here we go, the old love bombing I have all over my front door. All over my front door. This house is under video surveillance. Video cameras everywhere. If you want your ass on my video camera, just smile. goes on and on. Some damn Mormon probably sent a child up, snuck it up on the porch and sat it down. Well... I'm like Cleopatra. <laughs> well, I'm not a lot. I'm not anything like Cleopatra. <laughs> but anyway, I want somebody to eat my food before I eat it, because I know they're trying to get me. Am I paranoid? You bet your ass I am. That's why I'm 66. <laughs> I didn't die when I was 17. <laughs> Paranoia does have some uh, positive effect in a human being's life. So anyway, I've been love-bombed. It's Christmas time. Uh, they're, they're trying to grab the bard. <laughs> They'll poison me like they did Brigham Young or others. Uh, they, they're tricky. They're tricky. I want nothing from the Mormon church. I let Allison go to her little uh, uh, friend's house to go to uh, arts and crafts over at the Mormon church. And I told Allison, don't get into the religion. You're there for friendship, <laughs> not cultship. And uh, everything seemed to go okay. About five hours later, he says, uh, Dad, uh, can I go to the uh, Mormon church this weekend? I said, no. 
She says, oh, it's fun. It's fun. They don't do any religion there. <laughs> well, she's right in half of that sentence. They don't do any religion there. That's true. Well, they're trying to capture her. You let them go one time and goddamn, all they, they don't want friendship. They don't want association. They don't want fellowship. They want validation that somebody else is stupid enough to get baptized into that cult. Well, we're not. Don't love bomb us. Don't make our kids go to your church. I can't have my child play with your child because your child is a damn cult robot. They don't know how to play. All they know how to do is try to convert my 11-year-old to your uh, cult. So I'm going to pull back on that. I tried to be nice. I tried to be nice. But you try to be nice to a Mormon? You're wasting your time. Anyway, I'm going to fly out of ta Taipei here. I'm going to go up into Beijing. And um, I'll hide up there in the smog. And the Danites will never see me up there. Thanks.